Guys, you want to create .NET application and you want to install Visual Studio on your system. So this video is for you. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Guys, in this video, I will be showing you installation of Visual Studio on your system. So let's start the video. So guys, you can open any of your favorite browser and simply search for Visual Studio download. And here in guys, you can see the official website of Microsoft. You need to just click on this link. So guys, it will redirect you to the download page. And here it's showing me the version of Visual Studio. Just scroll down and you can see we have different options for installation, professional, enterprise and community. So professional and enterprise is for trial, community is free one. So we will be installing community. So just click on this button guys. And guys, you can see the download has been started. We will wait for it. And guys, you can see the download is done. To install this, I'm going to click on this exe. Let me close my browser, guys. It's asking me permission. So I have just click on yes button. Now here it's showing me this message. So I'm going to click on continue button, guys. And now Visual Studio installer has been started. So it it will take few minutes guys so please wait for it and now guys here it's showing me this screen where we have various installation option so depending on requirement you have to select so here you can see asp.net and web development component microsoft azure development node.js python development and .NET desktop development, Unity mobile application, so many options you have. So whatever you want to install, you can select from here. So I wish to install for uh, web development as well as desktop development. So guys, here I'm going to select .NET and desktop development. So here you can see this are the installation detail it is showing. So this all product will be installed. Along with desktop, I'm selecting web development option also. So for web development, all the required software will be installed and then guys here I'm going to click on this install button it is around 9 GB guys so it is going to definitely take time guys here you can see the installation has been started it will take time because the total installation is of 9 GB so we will wait for it and guys here you can see we have check mark the option start after installation Okay guys, so you can see the installation is done. We are getting option modify launch and more and you can see the Visual Studio has also started. So I'm going to close this installer and here guys my Visual Studio is started. Now it asking me sign in and create an account. So we are going to skip this. So just click on skip this for now. Okay. Now it's showing me development settings options. So what type of setting you would like to show in your this ID. So here we have general option and if you click on this drop down you can see uh, different programs language option is also there so whatever you want to select you can select I'm keeping general and here I'm selecting the dark thing now I'm going to click on this start visual studio so it has shown me this page guys and here it's showing me various options options for cloning a project opening a project and opening a folder and creating a new project so I'm going to click on create a new project button so now my installation is done I'm showing you how to create project in visual studio so guys now here once you select this option create a new project it will take you to this page and here we have languages platform and project type option so in languages i'm taking c sharp and in platform i'm taking windows and then here i'm taking console based you if you want to have other type of project web based or windows based you can select that option now guys now after selecting this option it's showing me this two console based option so i'm going to select the second one that is my console based application in c sharp so here i'm selecting this and clicking on next button now it is asking me configure your new project so i need to provide some details related to my project so i'm just providing a project name and here is the location if you want to change you can change so my project name is demo app so my project name is done guys and here in guys you can see the project has been created so guys I have taken C sharp as 
language so here it's showing me program dot cs so in this we will be writing logic and here is my code guys you can see this is the generated code we have namespaces we have classes under that we have main method so i'm going to simply print a statement so for that i'm going to write console dot write line and some of the message i'm printing in double quotes and after that guys i'm writing console dot read line so that it waits for me for pressing any key okay the code is done guys now let's quickly save this code and run so i'm just clicking on this save button and i'm clicking on this play button and guys you can see uh, i'm getting my output here on console it's showing me my message if i hit enter key then it's going back to my visual studio so guys this way you can create project and run in visual studio and this way you can install your visual studio so i hope guys by following my video you are able to successfully install visual studio on your system and you are able to create first project in that so guys if really my video has helped you don't forget to hit on like button and share my videos to your friend as much as possible guys guys if you have any query you can put in comment box i will surely reply to your queries or you can send me on my ig also i'm there on different social media all my social media link i have given in description box you can join that or follow me i'm sharing lots of pdm notes everything on my telegram you can join that and guys i have other channel coding in hindi code with sunita if you are really interested learning coding in hindi you can subscribe to that guys if you are new to this channel please subscribe to this channel and don't forget to hit bell icon to receive updates from my channel thank you guys for watching this video i'll see you in my next video till that bye bye take care keep watching and keep learning guys